another video of me talking, you know. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. It's been a cool minute since I felt like, like I reset my whole computer. I had to download all this stuff over again. It's been a real minute since I like even thought about making a video. I li I'm literally doing this out of nowhere. I'm gonna post this tonight, probably around 10 my time. But I just want to talk about a couple things. 2K22. It's really crazy too, cause I really be forgetting. Like I'm, I could really be a YouTuber right now. I could really be a 2K big YouTuber right now. But I can't play a game that sucks. Like that shit, not for me, bro. Like I do this shit for fun. Like when 2K gets their shit together, I will blow up. I promise. Like I will be up there. But. I'm just gonna talk about NBA 2K22, but before that, you know, I just be living life. Make sure y'all go follow my Instagram, bro. Follow my Instagram. Let me show y'all. My profile picture is black. T Y E E E E E Z Y. But I really just be living life now, y'all. Like I don't be fucking with the game like that. I recently, if y'all have been watching, I know a couple of y'all have. I tried to start doing the mixtapes on next gen, you know, but I feel like I ended up realizing that that game sucks but don't get me wrong current gen is terrible too like they both suck so when i see all this competitive you know which is better on tiktok and all this other stuff bro they both suck so i don't know what y'all are you know arguing about next gen has its flaws current gen has its flaws i feel like next gen is just so bland like in general but current gen is just repetitive everybody plays the same there's literally that speed glitch is the whole game like, I don't even want, I, I, I was thinking about getting back on that game and learning how to dribble and start playing stage and shit because it looks entertaining, you know, somewhat on TikTok. But then I, I realized, bro, everybody just wants to be like everybody else. So I'm not finna be, I'm gonna wait till they get a new dribbling system where they take out the glitch because everybody just looks like everybody else. There's no, there's nothing different, bro. It's either I would get back on that game and just do what everybody else do. That's what it, that's what it would be if I hop back on. And I'm not finna do that. I'd rather wait till there's a fun game to play and do that. But next gen, next gen is just so boring. Like, and the reason next gen is really boring is because current gen is still out and it's hard to get PS5s. Like there's still people out here hoarding PS5s. Like I was on a, in a Facebook group, like that be selling stuff, bro. I seen somebody, he had 72 PS5s, bro, all together. Like he took a picture and was selling them in the group. Like I'm, I'm just looking. So it's still hard to get PS5. That's another reason why next gen is, is trash. There's not, there's not a lot of people like, I can't explain it. There's really only hella sweats or old heads on that game. Like there's not a lot of little, that's why, that's why another reason why people say current is better just because they have it on PS4. Like they don't even, they haven't even experienced next gen, but they're calling it trash. But next, next gen is bad. I'm not going to lie. That shit is, is bad. Is it better? I don't know. They both have their flaws. So I can't really say which is better, but I was having a cool little time on next gen until I just got tired of it, bro. Like there's just, there's glitches in that game too. Like there's unstoppable hezzies, bro. That fucking build, that, that power forward build in next gen, that shit broke the game. That shit was terrible, bro. Like if it wasn't, if that build, like I'm a point guard. Tell me how I'm a point guard with a 90 something dribbling, like a higher dribbling, higher stamina than, than the power forwards. And I cannot get Hall of Fame tight handles. And you need to Hall of Fame tight handles to be able to do park size ups. So I can't even do park size ups as a point guard. But the power forward build can. Like literally, the power forward build gets like 10 more badges than me in each category. Like it's just OP. I cannot compete. Literally, I can't compete. So they never fixed that build. So that's another reason why I hate that game. I feel like I can't really compete. I can't really grind. Cause my, like when I'm playing somebody good with that build, it's, it's raps, bro. It's hella hard. Like I could possibly win, but I would be on my shit and not fuck up. And it's just too much. Everybody's just out there with the, uh, I forgot what the build is called. This is the power forward build. Next gen made me do this. After, I think the day after I did, no, this was the last mixtape I did. Cause I just lost some bums, like, but it, I just broke my controller. I threw the PS5 controller once, and this is what happened. Like, the whole thing snapped off and everything. So, you already know what I have to do. This shit happens. But I just want to say a couple things about NBA 2K22. What I think it needs for it to be a great game. And uh, this is for, I don't know. Views are down right now, but it's in general. 
I've gotten to a point to where I'm just so I don't give a fuck about views no more. I do this for the people who want to watch me and shit. I know there's a couple, there's some loyals that really be on my still on my Instagram, you know, keeping up with me and stuff. I appreciate y'all because y'all still be, you know, I be seeing all the DMs and stuff. But I got to the point I don't give a fuck about views, bro. Like I do this for fun. Eventually it'll pay off. I'll blow up. I'll start averaging more and more. But the game has to be good too. I'm not finna force myself to play garbage, you know? I'm not doing that. But, NBA 2K22. First off, if PS5 is not on the shelf by the time NBA 2K22 comes out, the game's gonna be garbage. Already off rip, bro. Like, if they can't put PS5 on the shelf, it's bad. It's just gonna be, it's not gonna be cool. If there's a lot of y'all still stuck on PS4, that's another reason why next gen is dead. Nobody even watches it because they don't have it. Shit like that. Okay, uh, let's let's another thing. They fixed the power forward build in NBA 2K22. There's so much shit they gotta fix. I'm not gonna lie. The dribbling. They tried to eliminate dribbling on next gen, which they kinda did because apparently I'm like one of the top dribblers on that game. No cocky shit. I like people really people really be saying i'm be doing some different shit but really i'm just trying i'm just working with what i got bro all the all the possible moves like there's a couple of little steezo spin moves that i haven't really been doing in my mixtapes but that's because y'all know i'm more of a standstill dribbler i don't even really like doing all that little oh i can't even do some of the, the steezo moves because you need tight handles that's another thing i think i tried to learn how to do it just just because but i couldn't cut off tight handles i can't get it my build can't get it but that's uh they got a fixed dribbling if PS5 is not out, easy to get access. Game's gonna be trash. New ret rewards, we be saying that shit 24-7. At least they put mascots in the game, I'm not gonna cap. At least they're still mascots. Damn near, they need to come up with some college mascots, some new. We need a new rep system. I don't know. They need to try to stop making the game so realistic. Y'all need to go, 2K, please. I don't, I highly doubt anybody from 2K is watching this video. But you guys need to go back just go back in time go look at some i forgot what do you call it some old mechanic yeah some old mechanics of nba 2k 16 or 17 because we keep saying those were the best 2ks ever and every fucking everything after that we've just been saying is trash 19 was decent i'm not i was good on 19 but in reality that game was decent like it's probably because there, if there was affiliations in, if there was affiliations in like other shit from like 16 or 17 and 19 bro like it would probably be, it would probably be way more lit but 19 was actually, I ain't gonna lie, 19 was a good game. It was just the way people played that made it trash, like running three locks. But I'm saying we need rep rewards. We need park affiliations. Like, I don't know why y'all just don't listen to us. I can't wait. If NBA Live, I, I've said this, if NBA Live comes up with some park type shit, some 2K type shit with good dribbling mechanics, you know, stuff like that, you know, free roaming with other people, you know, some you could get content with, I will go to NBA Live. I promise I will. I'll be gone. But it's just it's simple shit, bro. Like, I don't want to make this a real. If y'all want me to make a more detailed video, because I'm really just going off the top of my head right now, just to get a video out there. Because I know y'all been wondering about me and what I've been doing. I'm really just, you know, chilling. If I make a mixtape, I make a mixtape. But hopefully, when NBA 2K22 comes out, it's a good game and I'll be grinding again. Because y'all know every 2K that comes out, every literally every 2K that has came out. When it first comes out, y'all be seeing me, bro. Y'all know I always got a couple little blow up videos. And then when it, I feel like it dies down, you know, I stop playing and then I just, you know, I'm back chilling. You know? That's how it is. So I already know I have the potential to blow up and be a big ass, you know, YouTuber, again, streamer. And shit, I just need people, to, I just need comp people to play. I'm not gonna lie. I need people that care about the game a lot, but it's not going to play. I ain't gonna lie. Because I really don't have no no comp people to play with anymore no since NBA 2K17. Because I just, like, you know, stuff got away from it all so that's one thing i need i just need a lot of dedicated ass no life people to play with you know for streams and shit like that and a good 2k bro and i promise y'all i'll blow up off this shit this i'm not gonna say it's easy because it's not easy i promise y'all this shit is not easy but you just gotta have that mindset that you could do it i know i know i could average a minimum of 50k views i just need a good game to, that i enjoy you know that i'm genuinely having fun with so 2K, if you can do that, me, and if I'm enjoying it, I know there's fucking way more people's enjoyment, enjoying it 
because I know most of y'all are just like me. That's why my views went down, bro. Most of y'all are like me. I don't be watching no 2K videos because it's not fun. It doesn't look, it's not enjoyable, you know? So I understand now, bro. So when 2K makes a good game, we can be back, you know, even though we're older, shit will still, I'll still fucking play the game if it's fun. What the fuck? I've been waiting for a game to know life. I've been sitting here playing Apex, bro. Like, come on now. But I just want to get that out there. Hopefully they do these things in NBA 2K22 that will help you know everybody and everything make the game more fun make it more you know fun for me to edit videos and do shit and all that shit like that but until then i hope y'all can go follow my instagram um i'm always active on there if you have questions go follow basically the link down below has everything the link down below is everything bro everything is there so if y'all get that it's good y'all gonna see my discord my depop my instagram everything but until probably my next mixtape or fucking you never know, I might get bored and post the gameplay. Uh, I'm out, y'all. Y'all be smooth. Bro.